Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to cover about hemoglobin bats or Hb bats. Before we are going to understand about the hemoglobin bats, we have to know about the different types of hemoglobin. Hbf or fetal hemoglobin, alpha 2, gamma 2 chain, Hba or Hba1 which having the alpha 2, beta 2 chains and Hba2 which having the alpha 2, delta 2 chains. Now come to the hemoglobin bats which is also known as Hb bats is an abnormal type of hemoglobin that consists of four gamma globulin chains. Normally there are only two gamma globulin chains are present in the fetal hemoglobin. In the fetal hemoglobin normal structure alpha 2 gamma 2 but in the hemoglobin bats or Hb bats abnormal type of hemoglobin that consists of four gamma globins. It is moderately insoluble and therefore accumulates in the red blood cells. Hb bars has extremely high affinity for the oxygen. So it cannot release oxygen to the tissue and therefore this makes it an inefficient oxygen carrier. So the main role of the hemoglobin is to transfer the oxygen or the oxygen transport which is not performed when the hemoglobin bars is present in the RBC. An embryo develops it begins to produce alpha globins at weeks of 5 to 6 of the development. When both of the HbA1 and HbA2 genes which code for alpha globins becomes dysfunctional, the affected fetus will have difficulty in synthesizing a functional hemoglobin. As a result, gamma chains will accumulate and forms 4 gamma globulin chains. These gamma globins bind to form hemoglobin bars. It is produced in the disease alpha thalassemia and most severe of the cases. There is only form of hemoglobin in the circulation. That means hemoglobin bars which is seen in the alpha thalassemia patients and in the most severe of the alpha thalassemia cases only hemoglobin bars is present in the circulation. In this situation, a fetus will develop hydroxpitalis and normally die before or shortly after birth unless intrauterine blood transfusion is performed. This variant of hemoglobin is so called hemoglobin bars or HP bars as it was discovered at St. Bartholomew's Hospital in London often abbreviated to bars. So that is about the hemoglobin bars which is abnormal structure. In the structure of hemoglobin bars, only four gamma globulin chains are present and it having the high affinity for the oxygen. So the hemoglobin bars fail to release the oxygen at the tissue level. I hope now you understand about the hemoglobin bars. If you like this, then please share with your friends. Thank you.